picks. Wow. Meanwhile, a couple hours south here, closer to the border, Coach Sean Miller and his boys were hoping to finish off 2018 with a win over UC Davis. That's right. It was their last game until January 3rd of 2019. Let's head on out to McHale Center. And here's one Gato Loco. Oh, yeah. Wilbur the Wildcat will see Brandon Williams with a crazy drive to the hoop early on. And hey, later, you got to love the footwork of Ira Lee. Spinning and grinning and the foul. And after that, take a look at the passing by the Wildcats from the big man Chase Jeter to Alex Barcelo busting the three-pointer. And after that, hey, more nice ball movement to Ira Lee who will draw the foul. Arizona led by double digits in the first half. But in the second, UC Davis guard TJ Shorts was making it happen, Captain. He would get hot very quickly. Shorts would score 25 points, and by the time it got to the five-minute mark, UC Davis had come all the way back. Arizona would then trail by two with about a minute to play, but after the timeout, Justin Coleman with the three. Yes, sir. -y. That allows Arizona to retake the lead 70-68, to and after the timeout, final seconds, Arizona's still just up by two, but Coleman, he is very much off the mark. That leaves UC Davis one last chance, no timeout, under 10 seconds left. The ball is out of TJ Short's hands. Big mistake, and you'll see a three-pointer for the win. For UC Davis, is Roger picked up? No way. Jose, uh-uh. Arizona survives against a team with just a three victories all year. Final score, 70 to 68. There'll be lots to work on once the Cats return from the Christmas break. Here is Coach Sean Miller. You come into McHale Center right now, um, you have an opportunity to play in one of the great arenas in college basketball. Uh, we have an awesome record, and it's it's uh, people are coming in foaming at the mouth. Uh, there's no fear, and uh, it's up to us to reestablish that at least you're going to go against a really, really hard playing together group. Hey, next up for the Wildcats, Colorado on January 3rd at McHale Center. And we are far from over with after the break. We'll check in with the founder of the Nova Home Loans Arizona Bowl. And Hear why fans can be even more excited about this year's showdown. Plus, we'll have more hoops. There's a reason why there's so many big names in the Tucson scene making it out to Arizona women's basketball games. And we'll show you what the founder of basketball's great granddaughter is doing for gender equity in sports. More sports, more energy, more hooping it up. Next.